Aloha everybody. My name is Gabe and this is the Hawaii Institute of Self-Reliance, His Survival. Welcome back. Mahalo for watching. I am looking at Fisher 8. This is Fisher 8 right here. I'm trying to catch what we refer to as the surge. And I think it's just pulsing right now. It has died down and then started back up a little bit. So I think this is just a pulse. But there's a lot of lava coming out of that fissure. It is 5.30, so the surge should show up within the hour. And what a surge is, or this is the theory, that there is an earthquake at the summit, five point something. And then about two hours later, an hour, hour and a half, two hours later, there is a surge at the fissure, fissure eight. And that just means there's a lot more lava coming out. I believe this is a pulse, but I'm not quite sure. It could be a surge. I think I'll know uh, if it's the surge because there'll be breakouts along the river, overflows of lava. So, check the edges. I don't really see anything. Wow, that's a lot of lava. But I think it's just a pulse. But we will see. Wow, that's the most lava I've seen come out of this fissure, at least from this angle. That's a lot. So maybe this is the surge. Let's check the center cone. I don't see anything really splattering over or fountaining over. Okay. I think this is just a pulse. But we will see. Again, the pulse is different than the surge. The pulse, what I have seen, will last for about five minutes. There will be a large amount of volume or of lava coming out of the fissure and then that will last for five minutes and then it will decrease and it will be a lower volume of lava coming out. This is, you know, what I have observed, and that will, that low will last for about five minutes. Wow, that's a lot of lava. This might be the surge. Sorry about the wind, I'm just going to have to go with it. I usually don't like to have wind noise in my videos. But I'm actually glad for the wind because the SO2 isn't so bad. Yeah, I think this is just a pulse, and it'll die down. We'll probably have to wait for about an hour 
for the surge to arrive. Yeah, see, yeah, I think it's starting to die down a little bit. Yeah, I think that was just a pulse. And still a lot of lava. Wow, I mean, that's the biggest pulse I've seen. That's a lot of lava, and the camera isn't really picking it up all that well. Sure is beautiful. Yeah, it's dying down. So that was just a pulse. See how it's dying down? It's not as much lava. So we'll wait for the surge. Hurry up and wait. I'm checking out the edges of the river. And we'll see if it rises. It does look like it's rising right now. Wow, you see that? This might be the surge. Look at that. It's rising up. Wow. That's a lot of lava. But again, this could be a pulse. Scott Wilson. Scott Wilson is above me flying in a plane. And I am witnessing the surge. This is the largest mount of lava I've seen come out of this fissure from this spot. Yeah, that's... I think that was the surge. So much lava. Okay, this surge has been happening for about a half hour and it has not died down. It is definitely a surge. This is the most lava I've seen in this area right here. And it's not a pulse, because it just keeps going. I want to see if we can check out the edge of the river. Now you can't really see it. It's getting rainy. But yeah. There's a lot of lava coming out of the Fisher 8. Wow. Wow, look at that. Look at that. Woo! By my calculation, the surge has lasted for 40 minutes so far. And Fisher 8 has gotten louder. Yeah, there's a lot of lava just continuously coming out. It's not like the pulse. The pulse would have died down by now. This is just raging. Scott Wilson is still flying. I can hear his Cessna. Yeah, this is the largest amount of lava I've seen come out of the fissure for this long. It's just a ton of lava. Tons of lava. Wow. Let's see if we can get some splatter over the cone. Just a little bit. is that's a lot of lava coming out wow and it's splashing over that berm right there
look at that. That's a lot of lava. Okay, I'll check back and I'll get some shots of when the surge has stopped and we can compare the clips. The surge lasted from about 5.30 to 6.50 and now it is about a normal level of lava coming out. So you can think that the surge lasted for about an hour and 20 minutes. About my estimation. Okay, I'm gonna wrap this video up right here. Thank you for watching. The surge, the lava surge. Now we're gonna see a pulse happen. Maybe I'll, I'll wait for a pulse to happen. So now a pulse is happening. Now it's rising. Yep, so now we're witnessing a pulse. So the surge lasted for about an hour and 20 minutes. And now we're seeing a pulse. Okay, I'm gonna wrap this video up right here. I wanna thank you for watching. I wanna thank everyone for subscribing, hitting that bell symbol to get notifications for when I upload a video, you can watch it and tell me what to think. And until next time, a hooey ho!